And yeah, when you uh, when you want to break bone plating, always use your Q for the initial jump. And then, so like if you have fleet, you use your Q as you jump because it's going to proc the bone or the uh, fleet. And so you just get to walk away after. <clears throat> um, uh oh, like up against Aatrox or something. Don't do an auto cancel. Just do Q before the jump and just do that one auto because the next auto is basically fucking dead. You're not gonna get that much damage out of it. You're not gonna get that much damage out of the next auto due to the fact that it is, uh, nah, it's not the same Silas. It's getting reduced by the bone plating. So you don't even need the second hit, who cares? <clears throat> Your only goal there is to just break the bone plating. The then you can take a trade after. Look at Mumu on the flank, he's prowling, dude. Ash Nami though? Mmm, nah. This is not a fight you want. He didn't get the grass proc, did he? He's holding it. <clears throat> he's not gonna throw that. Gets his two. I need to kill this for level two. Now that I'm level two, my trades are huge. The grass prop. Tick rate be a lady tonight. Silas shoving on the swain. I'm gonna taste their blood. Oof. Keep fucking with his B. Get that XP first. I don't know if he lost any creeps there. Because I had them pulling into me. Yo, team looking good. Amumu with the roams, dude. This guy's a fucking terrorist. Oh, he's not gonna let me. So I just gotta get it under as quick as I can here. We'll just get the demo proc before the TP comes through. Of course, sky flash. <clears throat> we get this, this, this. Decent buy, not the best. Shouldn't have gone for the demo proc. It's not really worth all that much. It, it sets it up so I definitely get a play on my next shove if I demo proc, but like, it's not necessary, you know? I also should have been shoving immediately because I know that this guy is gonna do that. We know that he's gonna go for uh, the immediate back this time because we hadn't let him be the other times. Don't go for the auto there, if you're Cassante. You don't have the uh, CC that long. Damn, I should have W'd. 
setting this up. Get the shove on next wave, because they catch right here. Keep taking them in. <laughs> you just burnt all your HP for that, bro. <laughs> you fucking dummy. He doesn't know how this shit works. <clears throat> this guy does not know how to play Cassante. Nice. Good pick. Same with the Amumu. But Amumu died, that's why he's on a timer. The Graves was just smart. Not quite as commendable when you die in Rome somewhere, because you get the death timer. So, like, you're already working on moving somewhere. <laughs> Noobs hate being proxied. Oh shit, the arrow. Okay. So we got vision. Of course he doubles back that way. Fuck off, man. You gotta be fucking kidding me, dude. Ah, the uh, Ravenous was glitched right there. Shit, the proxy. down he could be on the way too we get accelerated pathing because of the thing there we go awesome gravy boy awesome I get to move over here watch for this fella Double W, just gives me a little more HP. We'll give it to this guy, he's doing great. They both use TP. I'll break the turret. I kill him? Nice. Oh, Karthus living! Kane isn't tanky at all. So just kill him if he tries to challenge me. Just he showed bot. We gotta hit this turret. 
Do I have demo again? I don't think so, not yet. <gasps> Let's fucking go. You saw me, dude? I just get the walk. Oh, you idiot. You fucking dumbass. You fucking bozo. That is frequent, frequently what happens when a Silas steals Rangar ult. They break it with their other abilities. It's like, dude, if you jump, you get like a free fucking dash on me, and then you can use your E, your W, all that. You silly fucking bitch. Move up here. Ah, uh, nah, we go to the, uh, go to the drag. Team doing well enough. He's got R in 18. He needs to try to stay alive until that's up. Did he just click the thing? I think he did. <laughs> oh, Graves used that. He doesn't get to hit it. Uh-oh. Coming. R in 10. I was going to give this to him, but... Great job from team. Ash Nami. I think I could just go on these two. Give him the kill. Click R. Go Vision. Then we turn onto this. Yo, yo, guys. They got zoned off. They got zoned off. They got zoned off. Oh my god, man. Team turned back onto it. You guys are fucking dumb. Or uh, turned away from it. They were off of it. Oh well, whatever. Forcing them to rotate over and over. Oh, JK. They're going for the 50 50. I, I got trust in this, Graves. You've been doing great. They turn? They have the turn? Mm, maybe not. This does not look like turn city to me. A moon didn't even R. Okay, well, I get a tier two, and then what do I get here? Tier three. Inhib. Silas was low as fuck, right? Got all these guys. Aw, oh, fucking A. Got one. Just one, though. Minute on that. I really like the IE change because... It, the IE Navori change because it is an offensive change to the game. It makes the game quicker. More damage, quicker game. It completely negates the quote-unquote durability change that they threw up, though. Which makes me question, like, why even bother, right? Why'd they do that? Just to placate the fucking poopy, shitty ADC players? Blast them back. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Break him. Cool. We take this first. May as well, because we're right here. He can guide bot. Yeah, we can end. We want to guide both, though. Don't want to flub it. Ah, nah. Never mind. If we had the Baron... 
There's no dragon up, guys. If we could move to the top side. They're getting caught. Just keep funneling them. Yoink him. There you go. I might have trolled that. Oh, we know. Bro, why is she on me, man? Get off! Well, the enemy mid is a pro player, so you can only guess what elo it is.